We could go on about this program, but the key point to note is that we can do highly interactive systems on a microprocessor with nominal computer graphics. And furthermore, the program points out perhaps the most fundamental problem in interactive computer graphics today, that is the problem of input. How can we deal with several simultaneous channels of input on a computer which is inherently a sequential processor? How can I have my feet, my hands, perhaps even my voice, all communicating information at the same time and have a suitable control structure and programming methodology that I can make full use of that bandwidth? a bandwidth which clearly the human operator is capable of providing. The music system which we've seen has pointed out some of these problems and has developed some methodologies for dealing with them. Clearly though, a great deal of work remains to be done and hopefully music will be in the forefront of those efforts.